Om Shanti, welcome back to your own channel. See the Sudha truth lies within, and now we're going to do the recording of 24th of March, where Supreme God Father wants us to transform adverse situations which are creating confusion in our life into the pleasurable ones. How do we do that? Let's understand this. God Father says in the heading of the blessing, May you be a karma yogi, somebody who's doing worldly things, who's into business, who's into job. And they are in yoga. Yoga means they are in union with Supreme God Father. They understand that the Supreme Being is watching us while we are doing every karma on this earth. And He is watching us and seeing whether we are being truthful to Him or not. Whether we are being truthful to the laws which have been laid down for us on this earth. What are those laws? That is what we learn at Brahma Kumaris. That there are certain godly laws for acting in this world. For doing karma in this world. So may you be a karma yogi and transform adverse situations of confusion into pleasurable ones with the trikal darshi stage. Trikal, three aspects of time, past, present and future. When we get to know that how the drama has been created by Supreme God Father when he reveals this revelation to us about the past, how this drama started. Because we don't know how many thousands of years back this drama started. What happened in that drama? Why is that relevant to us? Because we get to know how God had created heaven on earth. Now what is the stage? We call it as Kali Yuga or the Iron Age where, every, where there is degradation in the minds of people and also in the five elements. And then what is going to happen in the future? How the future is going to reveal itself into a pure manner and how this Iron Age or Kali Yuga is going to transform into Satyuk or the Golden Age on earth. When we get to know what are going to what is going to happen in those age stages, and ages then we get to know what we need to do now how we need to behave now so as to transform into that age so the children who are trikal darshi that means who know the three aspects of time the past present and future of this whole script which has been written by god can never be confused because all three aspects of time remain clear in front of them why it's happening for example why this war is happening between uk and russia well nothing new it is known what is going to happen in the future so it's nothing new why the coronavirus came those who were jolted by it because they did not have the knowledge of the three aspects of time they'll be confused and they'll be panicking but those souls who had taken this knowledge of the seven days they knew about such things are going to happen and can happen in the future too they will be thinking nothing new we don't need to think about it much because we'll attract it more with fear when your destination and journey are clear you have to go back home the time for this drama is over and the journey is clear you cannot become confused we cannot get into why it's happening. Rikal Darshi souls do not experience anything but pleasure in any situation. They are all about wah, wah, oh great, oh nice. Even if a situation is confusing, Brahmin souls, Brahmin souls are those souls who have the complete Brahma Gyan. That means they understand the three aspects of time. They understand how the creation has happened and that none of the souls will die or are dying. They're just leaving a body and they're going to the next role. So it's an act going on. So Brahmin souls would change it into a pleasurable one because they have played those parts countless times. So countless times means why? Because a soul, as a soul, if you think of yourself as a soul or consider yourself as a soul and sit in that consciousness of thoughts that I'm a soul, then obviously there won't be any fear, there won't be any hatred towards any sect, towards any religion, towards any caste or anything. And you will see everywhere whatsoever is happening as a drama just like you watch it on a curtain or in a movie hall and you won't be questioning it as to why it's happening it shouldn't have happened these people are not good those people are not good they shouldn't have done something no 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 a brahmin soul who has got the soul conscious knowledge cannot question the drama because they have been given the revelations by supreme being about the whole drama what's going to enact in the future too is also revealed so this awareness makes them karma yogis. That means so they are able to remember God. They are not about why, when, what, where, how. They know the complete drama. They just know that they have to remember Supreme Being. Because anytime if they leave the body, if they are thinking worldly thoughts, they again have to come into rebirth. But if they are connected to Supreme Being and if they are purifying themselves, then the chances of coming into the reincarnation or rebirth reduces a lot. And they do not, they do everything with pleasure. They don't do anything with or they don't feel anything is hard to do in their life. So with this, today's blessing, Om Shanti.